Hello everyone, welcome to Technology Tutor, and in this video I'm going to be telling you guys how to create a Windows uh, keyboard layout. So this does work on Windows 7, 8, and 10. I'm not sure about XP and those. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to install something called Microsoft Keyboard Layout Creator. So once you install it, you're going to want to open it up. And you will be presented with this. This is your keyboard layout creator. So what you're going to want to do is you're you're going to want to pick a font. So we'll wait for it to load. It may be a little slow but you can use this with any downloaded or non-downloaded uh, print fonts so let's say I want to try this one uh, and we'll do that so then what we want to do is we would just want to fill in these spots like our keyboard is made so for this one we have one two hold on I did that wrong this is the dash this is one this is two this is three this is four this is five this is six seven eight nine zero dash and plus and then you want to do the same thing for your letters and everything on your keyboard And it may take a little bit, but believe me, after all the work, you'll be happy. And you want to fill in every single space here. because if you don't you'll have keys on your keyboard layout that you can't use because you never did anything for them and then Z X C V B N M comma period and then the question mark and then space is space obviously and then and then you you can pick a directory so if I just want to save it to my desktop then what I can do is I can validate layout and then you want to click yes then you name it so I can name it num for dragon and then number dragon layout company I'll just say technolo tutor 
and then no copyright because we don't have a copyright. Right alt treated as control alt. No. You can you can set these if you want them. And then Oh. So we can you can only have eight, so I'm gonna name it Num Dragon. No. <laughs> Uh, drag dragon. I'll call it that. And then this has a spaz attack here. And then it'll take a minute to load. And then I'll say verification success or succeeded. And then you want to test keyboard layout. So if I want to write hi, hi there, buddy, and YouTube, I am Technolo Tutor. And then that happens. And it lets you type it. So then, if you go to properties, this is just the properties. So, what you're going to want to do is you want to build DLL. If you want to look through the options, go ahead. You can change it to whatever these you want. But I think it's all good. So I'm going to build DLL and set a package. <laughs> it might say not responding for a second. <sighs> and then you want to click yes. And then it will bring this to you this is your setup stuff so you set these up and then you want it to do that because you made it yourself so I don't I don't expect you to be giving yourself a virus and then you can set these up and all that and then you can X out of it and then you want to save it obviously and then you can save it to your desktop so I'm just gonna save it num no new dragon layout and then you can X out and you can after you set these up you can use them that's how you do it hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did make sure to leave a like and if it helped you make sure to comment down below that it did help you and you learned something new and i'll see you guys in the next video see ya